everybody. How y'all doing today? You know what I'm saying? Hope y'all taking care of y'all self today, my good people. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know what to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, share, and comment, baby. Smack that dope bell for me, baby. You hear me? And keep God first, baby, over everything. You know what I'm saying? On that note, my good people, I'm going to let this video take off. Play catch at 12 a.m. in the morning after she got back from Texas. And unfortunately, I thought that me and the twins' mom came to an agreement, but honestly, I don't know what we came to. But at 12 a.m. tonight, I will be going to the police department to pick up my three year olds. Yes, I said it 12 a.m. That is absolutely crazy because, uh, yeah, I'm supposed to pick them up at 6 p.m. So I'll be getting them six hours later because that's when their uh, mom will be landing. I asked if I can get them early morning Sunday, but she claims she won't be here after 5 a.m. So I will be in a weird situation. But nevertheless, I'm going to go get my kids. Um, yeah, I'm a little sad right now because it's just weird. Like, I shouldn't be going through this. The court has, like, set rules, and the rules are being bent by her. And it's just like I can't do nothing because... The only thing I can do is just say, I don't agree. I'm not going to get them and then what? But then I won't be able to see my kids. So like I said, I'm in a bond right now and I really just need y'all to pray for me. I prayed for y'all earlier in the video. So now it's you guys' turn to pray for me and hey, just try to lift me up. I need some very positive energy right now. Like that don't even make sense. Some very positive energy. I really need some positive energy right now. My head is spinning, but uh, yeah, here we go again. I'll be there at 12 a.m. to get my kids, even though the judge told me to send my mediator to get them, but my mediator won't be woke at 12 a.m. And I'm not even gonna call her and try to get her to do that because she has kids too. And uh, it's just weird, but hopefully when I get the kids, they're not wide awoke and they don't come into the house and just be all like energized because that's gonna mess up everything. It's really gonna mess up everything. But uh, I don't wanna sit here and talk to you guys too much. We had a great day. We enjoyed 24 hours off the game. For the first time since the game came out, I need you guys to drop a like on this video. That's like my symbol of clapping your hands. So I would normally say, can I get some claps? But y'all ain't here right now, so yeah. Anyway, this video is officially over. I'm already back on the game while I belong, man. Saving my brain, you feel? It seems like maybe Royalty flew back to Vegas to drop the twins off, and maybe she had to fly back to Texas to finish her work. Now, CJ was also answering some questions in the comment section. Now, you guys remember, D-Lo claims CJ was going broke. So someone asked, are you going broke, CJ? Please answer this question. CJ responds with, to answer your question, hell no. How could I? All I do is make money and save it. I don't do anything or buy anything because I have everything. Now, someone else also asked him a question about the twins. They stated, CJ, do you and Royalty get the twins week by week now? Or you get to see the twins differently. But I am happy the twins still have both parents cj responds with supposed to be week by week but she over keep them you guys already know royalty did state that she did get it approved by the court so i'm pretty sure cj knew that royalty was going to have the twins a little bit over because she's working out of town but anyways you guys leave your opinions on that down in the comment section below are you going broke cj please answer this question CJ responds with, to answer your question, hell no. How could I? All I do is make money and save it. I don't do anything or buy anything because I have everything. Now, someone else also asked him a question about the twins. They stated, CJ, do you and Royalty get the twins week by week now? Or you get to see the twins differently. But I am happy the twins still have both parents. CJ responds with supposed to be week by week, but she over keep them. You guys already know Royalty did state that she did get it approved by the court. So I'm pretty sure CJ knew that Royalty was going to have the twins a little bit over because she's working out of town. But anyways, you guys leave your opinions on that down in the comment section below. But let's move on to this next topic with Ty and Trey. Now, you guys know there was rumors going around that they may have been in a little situationship previously. Well, in Jazz's recent video, someone asked the question if Ty actually misses Trey. Do Ty miss Trey? Ain't nothing to miss. Mm. Some people were saying, judging by the look on Daisha's face, that may not be true. Why would you 
what you see. Daisha's a mess. Let me see how she messes. The stuff that she's trying to ask me, she already know the answer to. It's not something she don't know the answer to. She just want to ask, ask it because it's on camera to be messy. She need to ask a question that she really is wanting to know. No, that's it, that's yeah, like you're messy. So you guys think that Ty actually is missing Trey? Leave your opinions down below. Claiming that Dub set DDG up. Now he's still making videos talking about the situation. This is what he had to say about the whole video shoot and the underwear that he was wearing with Holly's face on them. Some of y'all should know me by now. Some of y'all may not know me. I'm the dude that's with the Haley Bailey underwear with the DDG dish. Well, I'm not the brains behind this video. Somebody very, very close to DDG is. Behind this video, it's a really, really deep thing going on that y'all don't know about and I'm ready to spill the tea about it. About a week or two weeks before that video dropped out, I ran into a person named Dub. Y'all should know who Dub is. It's DDG's brother. Here's the clip right here. Dude, this nigga do look like my brother, bro. We talking. You know what I'm saying? I told him, I said, hey, everybody keeps saying I look like your brother. Dude, this nigga do look like my brother, bro. Basically, he was like, you do look like my brother. Dude, this nigga do look like my brother, bro. Bro says, we need to do a video. We need to do a video. Wooty, wooty, woo. We need to do a video. We need to do a video. We got to do a video, bro. Come on. Okay, let's lock in. Let's lock in. Let me get your number, me. So the video that he wanted to do, taking my brother clone out or something like that. But then he was like, oh, I got a better idea for you. He tell me the idea for the, the diss track. I was second guessing about it too. I was like, should I do? I'm asking like, would your brother be cool with this? What do you do? was all like, uh, yeah, he, he he's a troll too. He's not going to be mad. You should do it. It's going to be a good marketing thing for you. So I get the pass. Like, okay, it's good. Let's do it. I'm with it. Got the Haley Bailey draws. You know what I'm saying? We got everything going on. So I'm like, boom, let's do it. So fast forward. I post a video. DDG blocks me on Twitter. So I'm like, everything was going to be cool. I didn't want, right, I didn't want to beef with DDG or nothing. I thought DDG everything DDG was going to be DDG, cool. So I'm confused right now. I'm like, is this an you know what I'm saying? Now, I just want to make sure that you feel me the way I'm thinking. You know what I'm saying? I'm thinking positive now. You feel what I'm saying? But the way I'm thinking, I'm thinking like, okay, if you got to pick your kids up, you feel me? And you got to have a mediator in between y'all where you can go pick your kids up, right? Okay. So it's going gonna, it's gonna to take uh, 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 royalty flying one time and then you got to fly one time. You feel me? If you got to fly one time, I'm thinking... Is your mediator going to be able to go fly all this time for you? And you say that she got kids? I'm saying to myself, CJ, you put yourself in this position. And as a man, you got to learn how to go get them kids on your own. But this is what you do, though. Peep game. You feel me? When you go to the airport, and you pick your kids up when you got to take them to their mama again, right? You really don't need no mediator because that ain't that mediator problem. That's your problem. You feel me? When you go drop your kids off to their mama, right? What you should do when you drop them off, tell her to come inside to pick the kids up in the airport. That's the way that you got cameras around you. You feel what I'm saying? That's the way you knowing that you ain't the one starting the trouble. You feel what I'm saying? But you got to stand up, man, be that man. Take that lick and ride. You feel what I'm saying? Do what you got to do. You feel what I'm saying? So, and by everybody talking about D-Lo say you're broke. I don't know why D-Lo said that. I don't know if D-Lo said that. You feel me? But if D-Lo said that, you feel me? I, I'm saying to myself now, do do D Lo know the whole truth about where CJ money, you know what I'm saying, where he's spending his bag on? Or D Lo don't know. Even though D Lo used to, I, I can hear D Lo used to manage uh uh CJ, he used to tell CJ about the money. He used to have one of uh, I think CJ cars or something. You feel what I'm saying? But I'm quite sure CJ probably got more than just one Master V card. You feel what I'm saying? He probably got more than one. Probably got two. He probably got more in the bank. 
D no problem no number. About. I don't know. You feel what I'm saying? I wasn't around CJ 24-7. D Lo no. You feel me? But to me, you know what I'm saying? If D Lo did say that, you know what I'm saying? I don't know what made D Lo say that. You feel what I'm saying? And I'm the type of person I look at D Lo. D Lo don't like to be in the middle of no mess. You feel what I'm saying? He don't like to be in the middle of no mess now. So, you know what I'm saying? This kind of shocking to me. You feel what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? If he did say that, I wonder what made him say that. Or what CJ pissed him off that bad that what, you know what I'm saying? He got to tell CJ Benny that he going broke. Because if he was going broke, I don't think he would be inside that same house. Because being broke, you wouldn't be in that house. You still got to pay that monthly. You know what I'm saying? If, if CJ buying a house, he, he still got to pay tax every year. You feel what I'm saying? So, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? He said he managed it monthly wisely. He ain't going broke. He ain't got to buy nothing. So, he probably using that money wise as long as he can stay there. You know what I'm saying? If he making money, we don't know. You know what I'm saying? CJ, you know what I'm saying? He known for making money. He known for taking deals. Two, three million, you know what I'm saying? To keep him going. You know what I'm saying? And maybe he invests his money into something else. We don't know. You feel me? But it's a lot going on around there with CJ and D-Lo, you know what I'm saying? And everybody else. You know what I'm saying? They got too much going on. You know what I'm saying? Everybody not focused on one thing. You hear me? Everybody focus on that bag instead of focus on how they can fix each other relationship, man. You know what I'm saying? That's what their main focus need to be on, you know what I'm saying? And they need to let women quit trying to be the middle people, you know what I'm saying? Be in between men, you feel what I'm saying? Men need to handle like men, talk it out and walk it out. And I stand no tea, no business about that, you know what I'm saying? When you got women in the middle of a lot of stuff, ain't no way you can really maintain a friend that if that is. That if D Lo, if y'all really, really friends, you know what I'm saying? Or y'all just doing this just to, you know what I'm saying, get a buzz. You hear me? So, and by the other girl, I've been new when them two was dating, right? You know what I'm saying? I've been new when they were dating, but they had broke up once. They started getting, they, you know what I'm saying? People started getting, I told a lot of YouTubers, man, they was together and they ain't together no more. So, you know what I'm saying? Ty and what's her name? You feel what I'm saying? Maybe she still miss, but you know how her sister bridge back. I think her sister just playing. I think her sister just trying to be, you know what I'm saying? A little mess, a little bit. You dig? I think just having fun. You heard me? And let me get to with this DG and his brother Doug. See, Doug talking about, yeah, man, they do a video, man, for promo. See, that tell you something right there. Doug is messy. You feel what I'm saying? You know what type of promo that it was going to pop out to me. You feel what I'm saying? But that dude, by him not being, he should have been like on point when Dub say that and to my, it's going to be okay now. He should have really talked to DDG straight up and straight up in front of that dude's face. You feel what I'm saying? That's how you get the okay. You don't go by because they blood and they thick in the water because blood, blood, you know what I'm saying? They go through problems. You feel what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? So, that was bad on him trying to, you know what I'm saying, listen to Dub instead of going to check for himself, but he wouldn't listen to Dub. So, you know what I'm saying? Now, Dub got him caged up. Now, Dub to my fix certain stuff. You feel what I'm saying? But guess what, though? That's that young dude's fault and that Dub fault. You feel what I'm saying? Dub knows exactly what he was doing. You feel what I'm saying? They doing that just to get money. And that's what I'm trying to tell a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? You ain't thinking about the consequence of your what your brother, how your brother gonna feel. You thinking about the promo. You thinking about that bag. You feel what I'm saying? You can't think about that bag when it comes down to your brother, even though your brother is a troll. But that don't have nothing to do. You should do should have been a man enough to call his brother. You know what I'm saying? When when he said it could be okay, he should say, okay, I'm gonna make sure. Dub had that phone when we were putting this, you know what I'm saying? They were dropping, you know what I'm saying, plugging in to each other on the phone. Dude should have just hit DDG. Hey, man, I got a dude, man. Woo, 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 look just like it, man. You know, he'd be good for woo, 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 woo. Then you let DDG him, you hit him on speakerphone and let you both on um, two men, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Speak to each other and see if it's okay. Why he doing that? You feel what I'm saying? Dub is messing, man. You know what I'm saying? Dub knew that this was going to start that fire. That's why he say, my brother's a troll. If you know your brother's a troll, partner, why you... Did that to that young man. If you know he was a troll, you know how DDG was going to feel. You feel me? But that young dude, the one look like DDG, he the one slipped up. 
You know what I'm saying? He pulled the peep game. You know what I'm saying? He pulled the peep game. And then he said DDG had quit following him. That shit, that shit automatically tell you something from the get-go. You know what I'm saying? Now you trying to spill the tea. But it is what it is. Nah, you know what I'm saying? You and Doug, you know what I'm saying? Doug cooked that up. He fried it up real good for you like a big old juicy steak. You know what I'm saying? And he had the tea like on a big old platter plate. You know what I'm saying, partner? And you ate the whole steak, baby. You know what I'm saying? You should have touched that steak until you got an answer by DDG. You know what I'm saying? But too bad, though. You don't eat that steak, baby. You don't got full. You don't got fat like an alley cat. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Tell you something, man. You got the peep game, man. You know what I'm saying? That's why, you know, your young people, y'all quick to try to get y'all, you know what I'm saying, platform to the top. You feel me? But you can't get your platform to the top if it's something that's going to hinder you and the person that you really don't elaborate with and you really don't click with this person. Ain't like you and DDG don't harm out and went to the club and DDG don't see you. No. Dub spot you. Dub just said, man, this dude look just like my you know, dude look just like my brother. You feel what I'm saying? So he should have went to DDG then. You know what I'm saying? So now it is what it is. You know what I'm saying, man? You know what I'm saying? You don't, man, look at man. Dub, dub don't power that dude played up, up, man, and then running all over. And dude, we got to figure figure out how he can wiggle up out of there now. You know what I'm saying? Because he's doing, man, I don't know if they're trying to ruin me or what. Mm. Trust me. You'll see if they're going to ruin your image or not. You will see. You feel me? And then I hope you be smarter next time. You know what I'm saying? Don't be quick to jump on nothing. You know what I'm saying? For you can get that promo. You know what I'm saying? So you can, you know what I'm saying, skyrocket to the top. You know what I'm saying? All money ain't good money, baby. And I stand on team, no business on that. I learned that a long time ago. You know what I'm saying? So if for y'all young, just to figure it out too. You did? Anyway, my good people, you know what I'm saying? That's the end. I'm going to scratch that. That's all I got for y'all. You know what I'm saying? I want y'all like my videos. I want y'all share my video. You dig? You know what I'm saying? So y'all know what to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, share, and comment, baby. And smack that dope bell for me, baby. You heard me? And keep God heard, baby, over everything. On that note, my good people, I'm gone from y'all, baby. I'm gone.